They were the baddest band on the planet. We really didn't care about how we looked. We went up onto that stage and we were crazy. We acted nuts. They looked like outlaws. Like their music was like nothing I've ever heard before. Profane and powerful house band rescued rock and roll at STA with a unique sound and life on the edge. It was a Tupperware party all the time. Bags full of bagels. You know, I look over in the middle of practice and I see Mr. T passed out on the floor from a bagel he just eaten. You know, blueberries all over his face, guitar on the floor. I told him to stop. He comes to practice is late because he's eating like three bagels at 14 us. Led by a mesmerizing guitar man, Emmy Mags, house band could inspire musical devotion at its finest. Emmy, ah. Oh. Emmy, best guitar player I've ever seen. Oh, Izzy and Emmy? Well, let me put it to you this way. When it was good, it was good. When it was bad, it was horrible. It was insane. And from day one, house band's greatest danger was to themselves. I did everything I could to possibly give up the bagel. I even tried during Lent. It's May 10th, 2018. One year after the inaugural performance of House Band, Mr. T will finally emerge in House Band at Rock on the Lakeshore, fresh off his bagel incident and addiction.